At long last, the torch relay begins in Japan for the Olympic Games. The torch is now ignited. Football star Azusa Iwashimizu was the first to carry the flame. 10,000 others will take it to every part of the country. It's shining a light on the progress made since Fukushima was devastated by an earthquake, tsunami, and nuclear disaster 10 years ago. On the long road to Tokyo, it's hoped the relay will generate excitement for the games. But many are wondering why it's still happening as the country is still battling COVID. It would be sad to see the Olympics canceled, but the priority now is to end the pandemic. We can still postpone it and hold the games when it's safe again. It could cause another pandemic here because people from all over the world are coming here. If it is successful, it will symbolize how we overcame many difficulties. Tatsuo Sugimoto knows what it's like to represent Japan on the world stage and compete against the world's greatest. He's worried organizers have run into too many problems to go ahead. All factors necessary for hosting the games are facing issues. There are sports that have held qualifying events while others haven't. When you look at domestic issues in Japan, the COVID infections are far from over and vaccination is not making progress. If the relay goes ahead safely over the next four months, it'll go a long way in reassuring the public and signal the end of a dark chapter in Japan's history. Andrew Chappelle, Al Jazeera.